Although the ATX MBX520 might not be the most popular bench in the ATX range, it may be the best value. It features a pretty basic design, which is extremely robust. Best of all, it accepts the um, ATX bench attachments, which add so much functionality to your gym. Recently, the ATX bench range was redesigned and re-released. So naturally, we've had loads of requests for us to do reviews on the upgraded versions. Now the MBX520 is probably the least requested for review. It is obviously overshadowed by its bigger and more flashier brothers and they attract most of the attention. However, I think this humble bench has impressed me the most as a man with simple tastes and a, I guess a bit of a tight ass with money. A great minimalist design really impresses me. So especially in these sort of hard economic times where everyone's sort of feeling the pinch and want to save a few dollars. Don't get me wrong, the more expensive benches are just mind-blowing in terms of their features and quality. They've really upped their game. But this little battler here can do nearly all the things that those more expensive ones can do, but obviously at a more affordable price. To deliver such a quality bench at this price point, ATX has done two things. They've made several improvements on the previous model. Plus, they've borrowed some of the design elements from the other benches in the range. In terms of the actual bench pad section, so I'm talking the backrest and seat, it is nearly the same structure as the MBX 650, 660 and 750 benches. The bench pads themselves are the same across all these models. They pivot with the same mechanism. So you have the same narrow gap across the range. One day we might even do a Pepsi style challenge to see whether you can tell the difference when you're sitting on the bench blindfolded. Now the frame, this section here and the back is made from 50 by 50 tube steel. It has reinforcement plates down here at the pivot point. The front support is 60 by 60 and that also has this beefy support section welded in. The backrest is adjusted by this eight mil thick plate steel arc and it has the angles all etched in on it so you can take the guesswork out of setting up for different exercises. Now the pop pin is a full commercial job and that is the same one that is used on the more expensive MBX650 model. The pin is housed in this even beefier bracket that's made out of 10 mil thick steel. The seat adjustment system is also the same as what you'll see on the MBX650. It is laser cut 8 mil plate steel. At the front, you have the docking section for the attachments. Once again, it is the same as what you'll get on the MBX 650 and 660, including the new high quality ATX adjustment knobs. Finally, it has a, a handle at the front to complement the, the wheels at the rear. So this bench is really easy to move around your gym. Don't get me wrong, this is a great bench if it didn't have the ability to use all those attachments. We are currently selling these benches for 665, which for a FID bench with this sort of quality parts and build uh, is amazing value. If you saw the similarly priced benches side by side with this one, you'd get a, a true appreciation of, of the quality. But I guess what makes this bench unbeatable value is that you can use all these ATX bench attachments. Even if you can't afford or don't think you need bench attachments at the moment, the ability to add them later on is a massive bonus. So many people end up selling their original benches and upgrading to a bench that accepts attachments. We've seen this so many times over the years. ATX have really stepped up their game as far as quality and design of their bench attachments. They've always been good, but they've improved in many ways now. But it comes with a price. They're not cheap. The MBX520 is the most cost-effective way of accessing these. 
A $665 bench and a $440 leg attachment may stay on steep, but together you are getting practically a dedicated leg extension leg curl machine. Now, the ATX standalone machine leg extension leg curl is currently around $1,400. This bench and attachment combo will give you, you know, say 80 to 90% of that experience. That is excellent value. And that's the way you should, should judge this investment. If you're on a budget, my two recommendations for adjustable benches would be either the ATX MBX520 or the base model Ironmaster Superbench. You might be looking at benches around the $400 mark. And if you can squeeze an extra few dollars now, trust me, it will be well worth it in the long run if you need to upgrade and get attachments. Both these benches offer the same quality as their more expensive counterparts, but it's just a more affordable entry price. Most importantly, both of these benches will allow you to expand your training later on with quality attachments. I can safely say that no other benches come close to these in, that, in this price range in terms of the variety and the quality and functionality of the attachments.